I'm Dr. Annette Jones, the California State Veterinarian, and I'm here to provide another update on virulent Newcastle disease in Southern California poultry. It's very important that we remember agriculture is a critical infrastructure. This has been declared by the president, the governor, and your local officials. That means those of us working to protect agriculture and keep the food supply moving are performing an essential function and will continue to do our work. But we are taking the appropriate precautions in the face of COVID-19 coming to us from our public health partners. We're implementing social distancing, we're monitoring health, and we're using all of the sanitation and personal protection recommendations that have been coming out to our staff. That means we took a pause in testing, but now we're to implement these precautions and now we're moving forward with our testing of birds so that we could hopefully lift this quarantine as soon as possible for Newcastle disease. That means we need to get through this final phase of testing to do that. So right now I wanna ask four very important things of everybody. Number one, practice good biosecurity. Continue good biosecurity is probably important for the life of your flocks, not just when the regional quarantine is in place. Do not move your birds. Don't move your birds, don't let new birds in, don't send new birds elsewhere until we can declare the area free from disease. And call us if your birds are sick. Right now, all of the sick bird calls coming in, it's not Newcastle disease, it's other diseases. But if it just happens to be Newcastle, we really do wanna detect it right away so that we could keep that outbreak very, very small and move forward to feed them from disease. And finally, this is probably most important right now, cooperate with our field staff. They have taken the appropriate precautions to make sure that they remain healthy and you remain healthy. So if you cooperate with our field staff, we can get through this final phase of testing and hopefully lift our regional quarantine within a couple of months. Thank you.